The greatest shooter in NBA history has become famous for his expressiveness in gleeful times, bounding around the court, pounding his chest and even putting opponents to bed when necessary. But Stephen Curry has long possessed remarkable composure when facing adverse circumstances, avoiding the slumped shoulders, finger-pointing and profane tirades that can become commonplace when losses mount. Late in the third quarter of a blowout loss to the Phoenix Suns on Wednesday, the Golden State Warriors star exhibited a rare breach of decorum. After teammate Andrew Wiggins was called for a foul, Curry's frustration bubbled to the surface and he punched the basketball high into the air. The moment passed quickly, before the whistle blew for a technical foul, Curry had, true to form, already calmed down and chased after the ball in an effort to return it to an official. Unfortunately for the Warriors, the trying times that have marked the beginning of their title defense figure to be longer lasting than Curry's split-second vent session. In a season that was cast as perhaps the last dance for a veteran core that has won four titles in the past eight seasons, Golden State is already grappling with the fact that only Curry has consistently stayed unbeat. Well before he capped last season with a signature triumph in the finals, Curry opened the campaign by playing the best basketball of his career. The 14-year veteran has been even better through the first month of this season, averaging 32 points, 6, 8 rebounds and 6, 4 assists per game. Not only is Curry comfortably above the vaunted 50-40-90 shooting splits, he is averaging more points, rebounds and assists than Michael Jordan did during the Chicago Bulls' last dance run of 1997-98.